other updates included um, CAR T cells. We've seen um, at uh, at EHA the, the updates of some of the, both the Juliet and the Zuma one trial. Um, the Zuma one trial is a study of of uh, CD19 CAR T cells with Axacel, the kite product. Um, this is uh, this was previously published in the New England Journal, but now we see long-term um, response rates in this um, in this uh, update and. The interesting things that we saw here was the durability of the remission. So it turns out if people, um, if people a achieve a complete remission or a partial remission and then keep that remission until three months, then they're vi very likely to maintain that um, for, the, the, for as long as the follow-up we have so far. Um, the fall-off fall usually occurs within the first three months both for partial responders, which there's a huge fall-off, and, and most patient, patients with partial response will ultimately go on to, um, to progress, whereas the complete responders are much more likely to maintain that complete remission. But regardless of whether it was a complete response or a partial response, if you made it to three months, then you're likely to maintain that um, response afterwards. So that was some, some interesting update as we learn more and more about CAR T cells.